What is Crackalackin' everyone? Welcome back to the channel and welcome to another reaction. And the trailer of the trailer, the daddy, the godfather of the trailers is here, in my opinion. I'm going to keep this short. Going into this, I expect a lot of spoilers. I think at this point, if you know, you know the amount of stuff that's been out there and this image came out and that image came out. At this point, I want to see a lot. So I don't know if all of those things are going to come true in this trailer, but I am expecting a lot and I'm here for it. And I don't care if this full the whole thing. So without further ado, let's do this. <laughs> right away, eh? <laughs> Ever since I got bit by that spider, I've only had one week where my life has felt normal. That was when you found out. Oh, you boy. That spell where you wanted everyone to forget the Peter Parker Spider-Man. We started getting some visitors. Ah, <laughs> oh, here we go. From every oh! universe. <laughs> Oh! Oh! Yeah! Hello, Peter. <laughs> You're not Peter Parker. I'm sorry, what was your name again? Dr. Otto Octavius. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, no, seriously, what's your actual name? There are others out there. We need to send them back. <laughs> So oh! Scooby Doo this crap! <laughs> you know, Scooby Doo this crap! I know a couple of magic words myself, starting with the word please. Please, Scooby Doo this crap. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit! They're flying out into the darkness to fight ghosts. What do you mean? They all die fighting Spider Man. It's oh. their fate. Do that. Sorry, kid. Yeah, me too. Don't. Look, there has to be another way. There isn't. They're a danger to our universe. You're not gonna take this away from me. What? Peter. You're struggling. Damn it. Everything you want. Oh! In the world. Oh! <laughs> from what Spider-Man 1? What's happening? They're starting to come through and I can't stop them. Show something. December 17th exclusively at movie theaters. Tickets on sale November 29th. Spider Monday. Well. Well, well, well. I have no idea how they were able to make this trailer and not show those guys. I'm I'm going to say those guys because, you know, if you, if you don't want to go into the spoilers, I'm not going to do that for you. I, how did they manage to do that and still made a three minute trailer with that much stuff? And if I'm not wrong. Hobgoblin, Harry, that was that? Or was that the green goblin thing from Amazing Spider-Man 2? Because that felt like the Spider-Man 3, Harry's version of Green Goblin, or we call him Hobgoblin. It felt like that. And there was that one moment, and like if they if they are bringing those guys back and if they're bringing well lecturers confirm we see jamie fox there that was willem defoe's voice we that's the green goblin that spider-man one dr octopus is there sandman is back freaking lizard was there 
It's literally the six, the sinister six. Obviously, they're doing that. They're just. It makes sense because it's like all these universes are colliding, and it makes sense to bring them all back. So if they are bringing those guys back, you gotta bring those guys back. You know, if they're bringing those guys back, you gotta bring those guys back. And I'm gonna leave it that. But kudos to Sony for not getting under pressure. I know a lot of people probably will be like, we wanted to see those guys, but this is good. This is good. Because to me, if they reveal everything, I'm, I was, I'm going into this, I was fine with it, to be very honest. Going, as I said, right before the reaction, I was fine with it because you kind of know, but like, if, if, if they don't show, it's better. And it's better they still didn't show a lot. And I, now it's more excitement because now we're what, like a month, less than a month away now for, from the movie. So it's like, yeah, I'd rather watch any of the big moments and any of the ooh and ah moment on the big screen in the freaking theater, you know? You know, this sold the movie for me. This sold the movie for me. That's all I need to know. Heck, the first trailer sold the movie for me. This legitimized that, yeah, my decision was right. And I think a lot of people will appreciate that Sony didn't spoil everything. Usually they do. And in this case, where they were expected to, they did not. They spoiled the things that I think we're fine with, but not spoil the things that we'd rather see in the theater. Even though we want to see them now, I don't think we needed to see them now. That's kind of my thought. So, it's a whole freaking Sinister Six is here. Everybody's here. What did I miss in the trailer? And what did you like the most in this trailer? Leave a comment below. Let me know. And other than that, I want to say thank you for watching. Thanks for all the support. If you like this reaction, there are a whole lot others on the channel. Please go have a watch. Yeah, take it easy. Take care. And I will catch you all soon. Until then, ta-ta. A-Cow. -ta,